So this is uh, Dana. I want to take a minute um, today and talk about the product I use um, where I teach over at Kishwaukee College over in um, Malta. Um, the product I use for my technology classes, I don't teach A plus over there. I teach um, the Network Plus, or Fundamentals of Networking, which is Network Plus. I teach Linux, um, the Security Plus, uh, or Introduction to Security. Uh, each of the classes at Kishwaukee has their own name, but they line up. I have lined up with the, the CompTIA certification objectives. So when you take a class with me, you're also training for the certification. So you're killing like two birds with one stone. But don't kill birds. So that's just a cliche. So, um, so testout.com is the website the students go to. They offer, uh, oh, I don't know, about a dozen, 15, 20 different products. Uh, you can go to their link and check it out. The, what I'm going to talk about is the, is the Network Pro. The Network Pro aligns with the uh, CompTIA Network Plus. A few years ago, Testout started their own certification uh, product called like Network Pro. Uh, it it kind of goes above and beyond what the CompTIA uh, objectives follow, so it goes a little bit deeper. So it's actually better. I think I think part of the thinking was, it's not just about preparing for a certification; it's actually about training to be an IT professional. So let me go back to their home page. I've been using test out for over 10 years, ever since I kind of got into teaching, which I guess has been about 10, 11, 12 years ago. So I've used test out ever since then. During that time, I've looked at a lot of different products, uh, whether it's textbooks, other products that are web-based. I, I, I owe it to my, the college, uh, in the school that I teach for, also oh, it's the students so I keep looking around, see if there's something better, something cheaper, and I, I basically waste my time because I can't find anything that I feel is better than test out. There's just nothing out there. They've been around for uh, 25 years, uh, 1991, the little logo there. So I mean they've been doing this for a long time. They were doing this, you know, like with Novell way back in the day. So. Uh, I don't think they offer Novell training anymore, but when they did, I'm sure it was awesome. So, uh, a few things I wrote down here. I keep looking at my notepad. I've uh, been around for 10 years. Um, it's web based, so anywhere you got internet connection, you can um, log into your account and do some training. Uh, I said they've been, together, uh, been in business for over 25 years, which is, um, uh, which is good. They're not going to go away anytime soon, I hope. Um, the other thing I like is their personalized service. So I could, as an instructor, I can call them. I can um, talk to my sales rep or tech support there. If there's uh, a lab that maybe I have a question about, I can call as an instructor and they'll, they'll tell me uh, kind of like the solution to it if I have to. But I'm, I very seldom do I ever have to call them. But when I do, it's it's top-notch service. Uh, the cost is, is competitive. So if you're looking at this website and you look at their cost, the price is going to be more expensive than what it would be if you're a student at a college. So if your college, or if you go to my college, and you sign up as a student, you get the student price, which is quite a bit cheaper than the prices they have advertised on their website for um, just people who want to do training on their own. Um, I talked about the quality of the product. I, I think I talked about the quality of the product. Um, I, I've looked, like I said, um, I owe, as, as a professional, I, I need to make sure I'm doing the right thing. I got to review my curriculum. I got to review my courses, uh, the programs, uh, you know, make sure I'm doing the right thing. And um, like I said, it, it's, it's um, top notch. So 
and I have a couple of different websites. Um, I'm just at testout.com here. If I click over here, it's called testoutce.com. Um, CE stands for continuing education, I guess. So testoutce.com. So this is this site's more for, I believe, students who are uh, maybe not students, but people, IT professionals who want to get uh, just training. Maybe they're not signed up for a college course. So here's some of the training they have. Uh, for for at Kishwaukee College where I teach, uh, we don't use CompPIA. We don't use their um, PC Pro product, but I do use their their product for the Network Pro. I use the product for the Security Pro or Security Plus. Uh, the Linux Plus I use their their product. I'm not currently using their CCNA training. I am using their uh, Microsoft 7410 product and I am using their 7411 product. At the college I'm, where I'm at we don't currently offer uh, a course that aligns with this certification so if we did I'd offer it. Uh, for the CCNA we all we do the Cisco Networking Academy so we use um, that product but at some time in the future I may start implementing um, the test out CCNA training as a supplement um, because it's so convenient the way it works uh, outside of class you don't need any special software you just need a web browser so if we make more um, that class be more of a hybrid class where we're expecting students to do things at home I may start uh, using this more often the instructor that teaches the the A plus curriculum he uses a different product uh, it works for him but if I taught it I certainly would use test out. So let's take a look. I'm not sure how test out would feel about this, but I've logged in and this is their server, their 7410 product, and I just want to tell you why I like this. So here's a simulation of a lab. So it's like chapter 8.1.7. Uh, you, you may not know what I'm doing, but it's creating a group policy object in in Microsoft Server. So I'm going to click on Start Lab. And the thing is, it takes a second or two to load up. The thing is, if I was going to create a lab using like virtual machines like VirtualBox or VMware Player or um, Hyper V or I don't know, whatever, if I was trying to uh, emulate or create a simulation or a practice. Uh, lab in the classroom using um, real equipment, it would take me hours to set this up. or uh, And I might not be able to emulate what they're doing here. So when I launch this, it looks just like um, basically like a Windows server. And over to the right is telling me what I'm supposed to do. And I'm not going to actually do the lab, but uh, I'm going to click on like the corp server, here's my my Hyper-V uh, virtual machines. I would go into the virtual machine and I'm just kind of guessing what it wants me to do. I'm going to go into tools and group policy management like you would, like a like a real server. I'll expand that out. Move some stuff around here. I would expand out the forest and the domains and the server and it's actually telling me to create a GPL um, and workstation uh, workstation settings and I, I run but anyhow I would um right click and say create a GPL on this domain and link it here and I would call it uh, whatever and I'm not gonna get this right but I just want to tell you how and show you how you would do it and I would go ahead and finish that off and when I'm done I would click done and it tells me what I did or how I did. My score is a 0%, took me a minute 43 seconds, 100% uh, is required to pass or I, that's kind of high standards but you know shouldn't it be 100%? I mean nobody wants uh, 
the brain surgeon that gets 80% on their tests. So why would you want a network administrator that gets 80% on their tests, 100%? So here it tells me um, I did each task wrong. And then it tells me step by step how I could do this correctly. So at that point, I could do it again. And I allow my students to do these over and over and over till they get 100%. Because I want them to not get 80 percent and be happy and go on i want to get 100 percent i don't require 100 percent but i highly encourage 100 percent so i take the highest grade they can do it one time and get 100 percent if they can uh they can do it over and over and over till they get 100 percent so uh that's one of the reasons why i like this product and then Everything they do is linked to an account back to the college's um, account with test out. I can see exactly how they did, how long it took them, how many tries. Um, I can see like what part they missed. I can run reports and see like if the entire class had trouble with one particular lab or one area. I can see those reports. Uh, we can when we meet uh, in person. I can I know what they've had trouble with. I can say okay guys. Uh, so I see you guys had trouble with uh, uh, creating a, a link in a GPO. So then we could go over this in class. I can explain in more details. Um, it's just it's just a great product. So uh, just what else on my list here? Uh, I just want to add that I get nothing for this. I'm not endorsing this because I get paid anything. I'm doing this because if you're thinking about being a student at Kishwaukee College or another college where they use this and you wonder about the training, um, I, I'm a firm believer in it. And I just want to add one more thing. So as new products are released, so let's say Windows 2016 server has been released and test out will be coming out with a new product for that. That's how I learn as an instructor. So it's like, like how do I keep up? Well, I can, you know, go online, I can read about the difference between 2012 server and 2016 server. But ultimately what I do when test out comes out with a new product, I, I get access to it as fast as I can, sometimes a little bit before it's officially released. And I start going through the labs, especially when the ones that are different. And that's how I learn. Um, you know, we gotta learn too as instructors. And uh, so why not? use to teach with the same products that I'm using to learn. That's that's how I feel about it. So I'll, I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something. And if you're in the Northern Illinois area and want to take classes at Kishwaukee College, uh, this gives you a little preview of some of the, um, some of the products that we use to teach the classes. So thanks.